What's up guys? Welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Diamond. I'm Poketch and in the last episode we defeated the fifth gym leader Fantina. And we earned our fifth badge. Now in this episode we are going to the next gym city and I think the name of the city is Castoret? Canavera? I don't know the name. I only know that it, the gym leader is a steel type. Let's just consult the map, bag, K items, town map. So the next gym is on Canaval City. Yeah, that's right, Canaval City. So let's just use fly and go to Carnival City. So we need to fly to Jubilee City and then we need to use a surf to travel for for the other side. Here we go. Road 218 It's a water road with the water type Pokemon. Oh, it's better I use a Rapple because I don't want random Pokemon here. Um, super Rapple. And let's put our Flame Chip in first place because I want to evolve this this Pokemon. And here's a battle. Okay, our flame champ is finally evolving into an Infernape. Now we have a cool and a strong Pokemon. Evolving into an Infernape. So we just learned the close combat, very useful move. Let's see the status of our Infernape. And not that much, it's very weak at the moment, we need to train it more. But it's a very good attacker, and a special attacker, and he has a, a great speed if you ask me. And yeah, he's fastest, po fastest Pokemon on my team, so uh, let's just train, no, I will not put Carpy in first place, I will put now Kadush in first place. I want to evolve him into a lack of them. That looks you just took out my my like my cadaver with only one spark and it wasn't a critical it was just a one hit attack one hit KO attack anyways I'm just picking up this berry and I'm going to use a revive on my cadaver because I Still need to train this guy. Okay. Revive. 
and now let's go this way and battle two fish monkers that may be an easy match cause my cadaver can defeat water pokemon Cannavale City. Now we are. I'm going to heal my Pokémon and buy some items after I enter the gym. Okay. Now let's go to the Pokémon and buy some stuff. No, this isn't the Pokemon. This is a uh, old, old grandma's house. This is the Pokemon. That's more like it. So let's see. Let's just buy some Ultra Balls because I may want to catch some Pokemon. Let's buy the Hyper Potion and let's buy some Super Potion. Okay, and did it uh, full wheel. Let's buy nine full wheels. No, I don't know nineteen. Oh, nine, one, two, there we go, nine. Let's buy escape ropes. No, I don't need escape ropes. Super ropes I don't need. Let's buy five max And there we go, we are ready. Let's enter. Let's go to the gym. And here's our rival drum. This challenges to a battle. So, Herrick versus John. So he starts with the Steravia at level 
31. It's a flying normal Pokemon. I saw with my Kadabra. He loads my attack, but I'm a special attacker, so I don't care. I go for my Freebean, and it made KO the star ever with one hit. No, it didn't KO. So he goes for Aerial Lake. Hope that doesn't KO me. And it almost KO me, but I'm going for a confusion and Sarev is out of battle. So, so I'm winning. So John's next Pokemon will be an Aerocross at level at level 30. It's a bug, fighting type. So one one Psybian shall KO this Pokemon with one hit. Aerocross is a very good Pokemon, but against Psychic type it sucks. But it survives my attack and he goes for a horn attack. And my cadaver is out of time. Okay, I'm going for my awesome, because I don't want to waste that spirit point of, of Aerocross on any Pokemon. So I'm going for a bag. That is, let's just use a leaf on Caddy. Now he goes for a horn attack and it chaos my awesome. And then I'm setting I'm setting out my Skadoosh again and I'm using a Sivian to the win. So that's two Pokemon out. Okay now. My scatters just grow to level 31 and John's next Pokemon will be a Ponyta at the level 32. It's the fire type, so I'm he is most faster than me. He goes for a takedown and it might KO me right here and yes it KO me. And I'm not gonna use another relief. So my scatters is dead. I'm going for my Carpy, and I'm using a Surf right here. It's still more faster than me, it goes for a Stump, it doesn't do that much, so I'm going for a Surf to the win. And Ponyta is out of battle. So, John only has two Pokemon left. So now we choose the Primplup, I'm gonna switch to my Valley. So we go for a Primplup at level 35. It's a water type, so I'm going for a Focus Energy. So it's getting pumped. So, in other words, that means my critical radio just grow. So he goes for a Metal Claw, and I'm going for my Shockwave to the kill, and it may get a critical, because my critical radio just grow. It's like... Plus... Plus two, I guess. And now we gonna get a critical. He goes for a Rare Relay. My body's still on the road, I'm going for another Shockwave. And I it may be a critical this time. And yep, critical hit. He survived it. He goes for a metal claw. My body's still alive. So I'm going for a payback to the kill. And there we go. Purple's out of battle and we get another critical. So, John's next Pokemon. It's a Rosilia. It's a grass poison type. At level 32. So, I'm going for a fly. And it may KO it right here. He Giga Drains and misses it. I'm going for a fly. And. 
when it KOs. So we defeated our rival John once again. And our body didn't go to level 31. So we defeated John and the gym leader is right here. Kind of a Pokemon gym leader Biron. The man with a still body. So if I'm not if I'm right this gym leader is a Steel type, so my carp in my infernal KO is steel. So I'm gonna heal up and I'm gonna enter the gym, but I'm gonna end up the episode right here. So, guys, thanks for watching this episode of Let's Play Pokemon Diamond Version. I'm Poketch, and see you guys on the next episode. On the next episode, we are going to take the Cannibal Gym. So see you guys.